in this video we are going to cover how to log into our servers remotely from your laptop we use a tool called vnc so when you receive an email with a server detail you will get two things one is the server name and second is the vnc screen so first thing you need on your desktop is or on your laptop is you should have a tool called vnc viewer if you have that vnc viewer already on your machine then fine if not you go to a server realvnc.com forward slash download forward slash viewer v i e w e r so when you lock, when you try this url you will land in a page like that and depending on your operating system if your laptop is windows you access windows if your laptop is Linux you Linux or if you have Mac you use Mac so you download a, teal, a utility called VNC viewer you don't need a VNC server you all you need is a VNC viewer so go and download the VNC viewer once you download the VNC viewer you install VNC viewer on a machine and so you type your name here enter your email address and then you click submit here by entering the email address here click on submit after typing the email address once you have downloaded VNC viewer you start the VNC viewer on your machine I already have VNC viewer installed on my machine so search for VNC viewer and I start the VNC viewer now on the VNC viewer you type the host name you receive I'm typing IAM demo you type the, the host name here might be different so you type the host name here and then the screen number which you receive I'm connecting to screen number 26 so the host name colon the screen number and hit connect you'll see a screen warning called unencrypted connection so select don't warn me again otherwise it will keep warning you every time you connect and click continue now here the enter the password which you received in an email so you will receive two things which is host name screen number and the password so enter the password and click OK so when you log in once you type your password you will land on a screen like this which will ensure that you have logged in as user oracle and this is your machine number going to be in my case screen number 26 which means I have IMTR 26 you type ID here ensure that you have logged in as user oracle and group oracle we are going to use user oracle for installation of software the staging or the software is under stage oracle and you have various directories the directory might be slightly different but this is the directory where you have all the software so under stage oracle you have all the software so this finishes how you can connect to our servers remotely using vnc just to recap what we did we downloaded a vnc viewer client on the laptop which you need to do on your machines start the VNC client and connect to the host name and the screen number which you have received in the email when you connect VNC client is going to prompt for a password and you enter the password which again you have received in email and you will land on a screen like this mm -hmm.